Caught in by gun, you better learn to stick your nose in there. Now, you've been sitting here resting on your laurels thinking, hey, I can take it easy. Now that Chevy Chase isn't in the picture. Hey, look at me, I'm Conan O'Brien. Put my feet up on the desk and phone in the show. Well, by God, I got a couple of words for you. You better get your act together. <laughs> My God, he sits there and he thinks it. He's sitting squat-legged, listening to some sacred cow. Andy, you keep that up, young fella. You're gonna be sitting squat-legged while you're living in a van down by the river. How about you, young fella? You got. My God, what do we got here? We got a big curtain. Oh, big showbiz curtain. Oh, look at this thing, huh? Well, you keep this curtain around here. I got two things I can do with that. I can towel dry after the shower to wipe my rear end with it. Hey, look at here. Max Weinberg. Hey, Max is going to play a little drum. Hey, Black won't give you jack squat! <laughs> we got a heck of a crowd here tonight. Look at this audience. Yeah. 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 I can't see real good. Looks to me like it's a golf outing. <laughs> You people, you're gonna go back to Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, or wherever you're from. Your neighbors are gonna say, hey, say, I heard you went to Conan O'Brien show. By God, you have a good time? Well, you're gonna be sitting there saying, I shoulda, woulda, coulda. <laughs> the old man's gonna keep an eye on you, so you better get your act together. What in God's name is that all about? Little old. Gotta work this crowd harder. Hey, that on. Do something. <laughs> we get some oxygen in here. Oxygen. <laughs> it drops down in the middle of the show. You'll be fine. <laughs> now, who is that guy? That's the motivational speaker. Where does he come from? Well, uh, anytime I grab a motivational speaker, I get a wacky pair of glasses. <laughs> <laughs> here we go. <laughs> no, uh, that was written by Bob Odenkirk. Uh huh. And uh, it's also a little bit of my dad and my uh, high school football coach. My dad would just like blow his stack. You know, like, like uh, oh, yeah, you know, it'd be spur of the moment, everything be honky dory. Then all of a sudden he said, I said, does anyone want to go to Gimbals? <laughs> Thought I told you boys to <laughs> shovel the walk. <laughs> what? So is the whole family like that? Is this your dad? Just your dad? No, we're all pretty loud, you know. <laughs> Real well, wait a minute, your, uh, your mom uh, peeked her head into to one of the shows uh, a couple of days ago, and she seemed incredibly normal, quiet, sweet. By God, she's a tiger going anyway. <laughs> yeah, no. She is, she is, she's very, she's the poor saint is the only calm one in the bunch. And all my brothers, and then, uh, and my poor mother. By God, I, no. <laughs> can, she re can she restrain your dad when he's like that? Can she deal with him effectively at all when he's going She tries to wrestle him down. <laughs> 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 no, uh, she, uh, you want a towel, by the way? <laughs> we could have. Uh, we should have a provision for hosing guests off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, tubby, hose down. Oh, okay. no. 
Tubby falls down, everybody goes home happy. <laughs> The falling down helps, right? Yeah. Always get to laugh. Yeah, it breaks the ice a little bit. You're a very physical performer. Nothing, nothing goes with you. Is that right? I like to be manhandled. I like to. <laughs> no. Yeah, Would I do. Like it. It's like a first hit in football. It takes the butterflies away. Because I was backstage, like going, "Oh God, they're gonna know I'm dumb." <laughs> so I just fall down and do, try to do something physical. Usually doesn't work. <laughs> no. But they love you for it. Hey, do you? Yeah. Hey. Burly bear. Yeah. All right, we gotta go. We'll have more with Chris Farley when we come back. So stick around. <laughs> <laughs>